this chapter is direction cosines and ratios this is one mark weightage in m set this video is useful for ap students and telangana students this is m set 2021 4th august shift to one question this is shift to one question here is find the direction cosines of the line making pi by 4 pi by 3 and theta here theta lies in between 0 to pi by 2 that is in first quadrant respectively with x comma y comma z axis now we find direction cosines here alpha is given that is pi by 4 and beta is given this is pi by 3 and gamma is given that is theta so we know that that is cos square alpha plus cos square beta plus cos square gamma is equal to 1 cos square alpha this is cos square pi by 4 cos square beta this is cos square pi by 3 cos square gamma cos square theta is equal to 1 cos square pi by 4 that is 1 by root 2 whole square cos 60 this is 1 by 2 whole square plus cos square theta is equal to 1 from this cos square theta is equal to 1 minus 1 by root 2 whole square 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 whole square this is 1 by 4 take LCM 4 4 minus 2 minus 1 that is equal to 1 by 4 therefore cos theta is equal to 1 by 2 from this theta is equal to 60 degrees that is equal to pi by 3 this is the theta value now we find direction cosines dc is equal to that is cos alpha cos beta cos gamma are called direction cosines they are denoted by l comma m comma n that is cos alpha cos pi by 4 cos beta cos pi by 3 cos gamma cos pi by 3 that is equal to cos 45 1 by root 2 1 by 2 1 by 2 this is the direction cosines of the given line the direction cosines of the line passing through p 2 comma 3 comma minus 1 and the origin r this is m say 2021 4th August shift to question. Now here the point P is given that is P and origin. Origin O is 0, 0, 0 and the point P is 2, 3, minus 1. Now find the direction cosines. First we find direction ratios DRs. DRs is equal to A, comma, B, comma, C is equal to this is the formula x2 minus x1 y2 minus y1 z2 minus z1 this is x2 minus x1 2 minus 0 this is 3 minus 0 minus 1 minus 0 that is 2 comma 3 comma minus 1 now we find under root of a square plus b square plus c square under root of 2 square plus 3 square plus minus 1 whole square that is 4 plus 9 plus 1 is equal to root 14. Now find direction cosines. DC is equal to that is 2 by root 14, 3 by root 14, comma minus 1 by root 14. Or minus, multiplying by minus that is minus 2 by root 14, minus 3 by root 14, 1 by root 14. These are the direction cosines of the given points. Suppose L1 and L2 are two lines having direction ratios 1 comma minus 2 comma minus 2 and 0 comma 2 comma 1 respectively. If the direction cosines of a line perpendicular to both L1 and L2 or L comma M comma N then find the value of mod L plus mod M plus mod N is dash here is given two lines are perpendicular per now we find the direction cosines of a line perpendicular to both the lines L1 and L2 
So now, first we take cross product of that two direction ratios, that is i, j, k. This is 1 minus 2 minus 2, 0 to 1. This is the shortcut method that is equal to i of minus 2 plus 4 minus j of 1 minus 0 plus k of 2 minus 0. That is equal to 4 minus 2, 2i minus j plus 2k. This is the vector. Here direction ratios drs is equal to 2 comma minus 1 comma 2. And now we find direction cosines. These direction ratios are denoted by a comma b comma c. First we find under root of a square plus b square plus c square is equal to that is 2 square 4 minus 1 whole square 1 and 2 square 4 that is equal to root 9 that is equal to 3. And d c is equal to that is 2 by 3 minus 1 by 3 2 by 3. These are the direction cosines. These are L comma M comma N. Now we find mod L plus mod M plus mod N. That is equal to mod L is 2 by 3 and mod less of M is 1 by 3 and mod N is 2 by 3. That is equal to pi by 3. That is the required answer. If 2 comma minus 1 comma 2 and k comma minus 3 comma minus 5 are the triads of direction ratios of two lines, the angle between the lines is 60 degrees, then dash, find the relation between k. This is MZ 2021, 5th August 6 to 2 question. Here angle is given, we know that here direction ratios and angle is given. So formula for this is that is cos theta is equal to a1 a2 plus b1 b2 plus c1 c2 by under root of a1 square plus b1 square plus c1 square into under root of a2 square plus b2 square plus c2 square cos theta that is cos 60 is equal to a1 a2 that is 2 into k this is 2k plus b1 b2 minus 1 into minus 3 this is plus 3 c1 c2 2 into minus 5 this is minus 10 by under root of a1 square plus b1 square plus c1 square that is 4 plus 1 plus 4 into under root of a2 square plus b2 square plus c2 square that is k square plus 9 plus 25. Here cos 60 is 1 by 2. That is equal to 2k plus 3 minus 10. This is minus 7 by under root of 4 plus 1 plus 4. This is 9 is 3 into under root of k square plus 9 plus 25. This is 34. So take cross multiplication. This is 3 of under root of k square plus 34 is equal to 2 into 2k 4k minus 2 into 7 14 and squaring on both sides that is squaring on both sides that is 9 into k square plus 34 that is equal to 4k minus 14 whole square this is 9k square plus 9 into 34 that is 9 4 is 36 9 3 is 27 this is 306 is equal to 4k minus 14 whole square this is 16k square plus 14 square this is 196 minus 14 into 4 this is 56 into 2 this is 112k here 16k square minus 9k square. This is 7k square minus 112k. 196 minus 306. So subtracting these two. So that is 196 minus 306. This is 0. So 1. This is 110. Minus 
110 is equal to 0. This is the relation between the k that is 7k square minus 112k minus 110 is equal to 0. This is the required answer. Suppose the distance of a point P from the origin is 63. The direction ratios of the line OP are 3 comma minus 2 comma 6. Then the coordinates of the point P. Here is given that is O point origin is given and the point P that is P is given. So now find the equation of the line OP bar. This is passing through origin 0 comma 0 and having direction ratios 3 comma minus 2 comma 6 that is formula is x minus x1 by a is equal to y minus y1 by b is equal to z minus z1 by c here x1 y1 z1 is origin 0 comma 0 comma 0 that is x by 3 y by minus 2 z by 6 is equal to taken as lambda from this x comma y comma z the point p is equal to 3 lambda comma minus 2 lambda comma 6 lambda and the distance is given from origin to p op is equal to 63 is given that is op is under root of 3 lambda whole square this is 9 lambda square minus 2 lambda whole square 4 lambda square plus 6 lambda square this is 36 lambda square is equal to 63 from this 36 plus 4 plus 9 root 49 lambda square is equal to 63 from this 7 lambda is equal to 63 lambda is equal to 63 by 7 this is 9 times cancel 7 nines are 63 therefore lambda is equal to 9 therefore the point P is the point P is this is 3 lambda comma minus 2 lambda 6 lambda this is 3 lambda 3 into 9 minus 2 into 9 6 lambda 6 into 9 that is equal to 3 into 9 27 minus 2 into 9 minus 18 6 into 9 this is 54 this is the required point P If 1 comma 2 comma 3 and minus 1 0 1 are direction ratios of two rays OA bar and OB bar respectively, then the direction cosines of normal to the plane AOB are this is M set 2021 6th August shift to question. Now we find direction ratios of a normal to the plane AOB are direction ratios of a normal of a normal to the plane a o b r that is equal to this is i j k 1 2 3 minus 1 0 1 that is equal to i of 2 minus 0 minus j of 1 plus 3 plus k of 0 plus 2 that is equal to 2i minus 4j plus 2k now here direction ratios drs is equal to 2 comma minus 4 comma 2 that is equal to 1 comma minus 2 comma 1 now we find under root of a square plus b square plus c square a value is 1 b value is minus 2 and c value is 1 that is 1 square plus minus 2 whole square plus 1 square is equal to root 6 therefore direction cosines is equal to that is 1 by root 6 minus 2 by root 6 and 1 by root 6 these are the direction cosines or r that is multiplying by minus this is minus 1 by root 6 2 by root 6 minus 1 by root 6 this is the required answer